where I want to start. It's winter, so of course there's not a lot of beach action going on at the moment, but there are public pools and they're busy. They cater for dedicated swimmers as well as families, couples that want to splish splash all year round. But what if you're in the water and right there are some women in G-string bikinis? Yes, thongs, the thong, thong, thongs. Does it offend you? Are these cheeky outfits appropriate around kids of all ages? Well, one woman wants to know. She's a mother of a three. She started a petition, she says, out of curiosity to whether she has the backing to ask a popular public poll in New Plymouth to ban G-strings being worn. Amy Dixon wants to see whether she's a prude or if other parents are also uncomfortable about having their children being exposed to skimpy swimwear. She says she doesn't want to be an overprotective mum, but has called some of the G-string wearers pornographic. Amy Dixon joins me now. Hello, Amy. Hello, how are you? I am good, Amy. You knew this was going to get a lot of attention, but tell me first up, are you a prude? Oh, I guess I guess some people would think so. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Part of me feels like this is just common sense kind of stuff. Um, yeah, well, let's, but let's, lots of people let's... have differing opinions. So okay, that's well fine. that's good. Just 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 like bottoms, we've all got them opinions. So look, what made you start the petition? Because you're you, you were saying a bit of it is out of curiosity, but also because it kind of spurred you when you were. Uh, at your son's swimming lesson, um, who's eight years old. So you've got three three boys, haven't you? What are their ages? So, yeah, eight, 12 and 14. Okay, so who was who was at the swimming lesson when you first spotted um, the children? So my eight-year-old was and my 12-year-old comes along to have a swim as well. Well, he's having okay. swimming lessons. Yeah. So there's been G-string bikinis everywhere we've been all summer long. But on this particular day, the style of G-string bikini, from the back it looked like this woman had nothing on. So she just, it was very stringy, red string and not barely anything covering the front as well. Mm -hmm. um, and I guess for me it was like, this is, is this crossing a line? Yes, we don't feel comfortable around the G-string bikinis anywhere, but we can kind of remove ourselves. But here I am at my kids' swimming lessons with lots of other families and it just um, made me re feel really uncomfortable. And I was just kind of looking at my kids, hoping they wouldn't catch a glimpse of her, to be honest. like. <laughs> so, so, but yeah. you've said a couple of times it made you feel uncomfortable, Amy. How do you know it made your son feel uncomfortable? Um, we have had moments where we've been out in public where they've said, can we move? Can we actually move? We don't want to see this. Can we move away? So, um I guess out of that mum instinct of being like, this is a family space, do we really need to see this? Um, I just thought, hey, let's see how other people are feeling as well. <laughs> so, so it was in a it was the, the, your, your son. Your son was having a swimming lesson, so it's a fam. It was a family pool. Were these? Yeah. What was the ages of this? Was it a woman, a young teen? Do you do you kind of guess? Yeah, a lot of them are like teenagers or young adult women that are. Um, wearing the G-string bikinis. Obviously, were they just strolling disappointing... around the pool or were they in the water? What were they doing? Um, well, it's it's a small pool. I guess you stroll from here to there and then go to the spa and then move around. So, um, yeah. <laughs> I wonder... I, 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 like I, else, I just... But... Yeah. So, you, you, do you think... It, it, it possibly could be because it's a public space. Do you, do you, did you think maybe it could be a bit of body shaming to do this? Um, I, I just think people feel differently about this. I'm, I, these girls are obviously gorgeous. They've obviously got the bodies to pull off these bikinis, right? Um, so it's not about. I don't want to shame them. I wouldn't go up and make these comments to them. But I just think there are people in the community who don't feel comfortable. Maybe we all have different ideas of what um, positive body, body image expression looks like. Um, mm. And is this the right space for these girls to be expressing themselves in that way with families around with people who come from all different backgrounds and belief systems and um, cultures? And yeah, we all have different opinions on this and what we 
allow our children to look at in our homes. Um, so do so we, we want to go to swimming what, pools? And what, did you, what would you make of, of men wearing, you know, the budgie smugglers, small togs? Um, I haven't really been around men wearing budgie smugglers, but I'm kind of like, if, if everything's covered, like... <laughs> Mm. I don't really have a problem if they're going there to swim or are they going there to parade themselves around with, you know. I guess I'm not there to please them either, but I guess it's just going how do we feel as a community about this issue and does it does it make enough people feel uncomfortable? Does it create a barrier for people coming into those spaces? Um, because whether it's right or wrong, people do feel uncomfortable about it. Other people don't care. That's okay. 